It's iconic footage replayed countless times across the globe. American astronauts planting the stars and stripes on man's newly conquered neighbor. It's got to be one of the most proud moments of my life, I guarantee you. To find out if it really was a PR stunt, conspiracy theorists believe the vacuum in space means these footprints are fake, and that flag shouldn't be flapping. This whole idea that the conspiracy theorists have is based on the fact that there is no wind or atmosphere in a vacuum, nothing to, to blow the flag around. And they would be right about that fact. Ow. Sorry. The shaft is a little tight in the hole. My belief is that the astronauts moved the flag around as they were planting it in the surface of the moon, and that momentum is actually what they saw as a breeze. So to test this, I'll be building a replica of the lunar flag assembly, and then we'll put that in a vacuum, and I'll build a mechanism to rotate it the same way the astronauts did. Then we'll see if we get the same flapping motion. So you know how to use this thing? Oh, yeah. And you're actually going to let us use it? Yeah, I think I will. Let's just uh, be careful. He's obviously never seen the show before. <laughs> It looked like they cut the arms off of a spacesuit. Is that and wait, does your head go here? Yeah, that's that, where it goes. <laughs> that's awesome. How much are these gloves worth? Uh, approximately, they're worth almost a half a million dollars. Michael really hasn't seen the show before. Cap out! Cap out! It's a portable hug. So you're gonna show us how to use these? Sure, I'll try to do my best to get you guys to do your hand checked. Fingernails need to be kind of shortened up and clipped. Uh, the arms are everything I expected. They're all 1950s pop space movie looking kind of robot arms. The only downside is I gotta cut my fingernails. Carrie, Grant, and Tori have breached NASA's inner sanctum. Now, the conspiracy theorists think that they see some sort of breeze blowing around the flag, which you wouldn't have on the moon since there's no atmosphere. So, I've built a replica of the lunar flag assembly. We're going to put it in a vacuum chamber, pump out all the air, and see if we can move it around just like the astronauts would have done placing it on the moon. See if we see that back and forth motion. All right, time for the flag. The flag assembly is an exact replica of the one used on the Apollo missions. The horizontal rod specifically prevents the flag collapsing in a windless environment. Hey, Grant, this is your first rig in space. I gotta go. First up, to confirm the rig in space is working is the all-important control. You guys ready? Yeah. All right, mm -hmm. this is the control. at regular atmospheric pressure and uh, I'm just gonna shake the flag as if I were an astronaut planting it in the surface of the moon all right ready be the astronaut here we go three two one all right it's moving and ready as expected, the momentum of the twisting and turning quickly dissipates, and the flag is stationary in no time at all. Okay, I guess we uh, put a vacuum on it and see what happens. All right, let's start sucking the air out. So vacuum tectona turns on the pumps. This is flag-waving test in a vacuum. Planting it on the surface of the moon and stop. Oh, it's moving a lot. Hey, it's moving a lot. It's moving a lot. It's moving a lot. I mean, still moving. That's awesome. There you Without drag or friction from the air, the momentum of Grant's planting action lasts for a surprising amount of time. Right. Could be mistaken for a breeze. Yeah. But it's lower air resistance. Comparing it to the control in regular atmospheric pressure illustrates that theory beautifully. 
So in the vacuum, the flag moved, you know, not just a little bit. It actually moved quite a bit. So that proves you don't need wind in order to move the flag in a vacuum. So unless someone finds a shot of the flag flapping without an astronaut manipulating the flagpole, it's myth busted. We've come all the way to Alabama and NASA to find out once and for all if the conspiracy theorists were correct. Where are we at? Well, we showed that a moon boot can make a footprint in lunar dust inside of a vacuum. So that one's busted. And momentum alone will keep a flag waving in a vacuum. You don't need any wind. So NASA 2, conspiracy theorists, zero.